It's been one year since Final Fantasy 16 launched on PlayStation 5. The most recent mainline installment in Square Enix's beloved franchise received positive reviews upon launch, but didn't sell as much as the publisher wanted. That's one of the reasons that pushed Square Enix to switch to a full-on multi-platform strategy, as revealed last month with the new business plan. With regards to Final Fantasy 16 specifically, we already know that a PC version is being made, and it shouldn't be far off its launch. However, in a message posted on the official Twitter slash X account to celebrate the first anniversary, game director Hiroshi Takai seemed to tease an even bigger audience when he said the studio would like Final Fantasy 16 to be available for as many people as possible. Xbox fans have taken that as a hint that the game could launch on Microsoft's console, too. That doesn't seem too far-fetched after the launch of Final Fantasy XIV and the open commitment to Xbox moving forward expressed by new Square Enix CEO Takashi Kiryu. Of course, it all depends on the specifics of the timed exclusivity agreement Square Enix originally signed with Sony. If it does happen, Xbox users will likely receive a complete edition that includes the recently released Final Fantasy XVI DLCs, Echoes of the Fallen and the Rising Tide. Producer Naoki Yoshida already said that was probably going to happen with the PC version. One year ago today, on the June 22, 2023, the latest mainline installment in the Final Fantasy franchise was released on PS5. Final Fantasy 16 is perhaps the furthest that Square Enix's mainline series has ever strayed from its traditional formula, going full-action RPG, complete with Devil May Cry's combat. But its bold new direction didn't stop it from receiving incredibly positive reviews, with many calling it the best single-player Final Fantasy title in over a decade. Looking back on our own Final Fantasy 16 PS5 review, we awarded it an excellent 9-10 and gushed about its utterly stunning boss fights. At its best, Final Fantasy 16 is a jaw-dropping epic of rarely seen proportions, we wrote. It's pretty much the pinnacle of cinematic spectacle in modern games. Meanwhile, Final Fantasy 16 currently has a Push Square user rating of 8.4 out of 10, which ranks it as the seventh best Final Fantasy game on PlayStation, according to our best Final Fantasy games list. Impressive. But now that we're one year removed from all of the hype and we've all had time to mull through our opinions, what are your thoughts on Final Fantasy 16? Vote in our polls and then explain yourself in the comments section below.